1996, I found out yesterday this thing doesn't have brakes. Let's show you guys what it does. All right, we just said our goodbyes in Kelowna and now we're on the road back home. We're just gonna stop and see if we can drive by the Daily Driven Exotics house here and then we're on our way home. No way, so we found it, it's right here and it's very, very close to my aunt and uncle's place, like very close. So they have their main house here, a pool and then the garage because I saw it in a video about two or three weeks ago. So that's really cool. Oh! So we had to make one little stop downtown Kelowna because Kelowna is so foreign in my brain. I've been, I used to come here once a year to visit my family for Easter and I don't think I've ever been downtown. There's the statue thing I was talking about. Okay, we're gonna go over there and I'll show you guys that. Okay, this is what I was talking about. There's Ogopogo and there's this statue of three dinosaur claws. <laughs> know what it is let this lady cross and a lot of cool patios here you have a great view okay there is an earl's here boom all right we now find ourselves in vernon this morning i was just thinking hey are we driving through vernon maybe we'll stop at, at evan's place and check out his parents place out here so i got sarah to message him on instagram since i don't have a phone Bada bing, bada boom, set it up. We'll see you there. Oh yeah, here a rubbing, baby. So I'm pretty sure this is Evan's place here. Alright, so our plan was to just stop in Vernon and see Adonica, Andrew, and Evan, just say hi and then keep on driving home. But they said, stay a night, come out and stay a night. So we thought about it and we're like, you know what, let's stay a night out here. So that's what we're doing now. Let me just set cruise here. Surprise brake check. Oh, I didn't know that. Oh, skateboard almost hit your head. All right, a little update here. We will be hitting Revelstoke in 45 kilometers. The car is still slow. I'll give you a little taste here. in Revelstoke and we're just here for a good time not a long time I hope a long time well done. okay Sarah's doing the honors of checking it out here checking the oil I should say it is in the full one good perfect all right I just checked the coolant as well it was a tiny bit low but I'm not too worried about it I'll just give you guys a walk around again if you're new to seeing this pickup and transformation Driving it across the country. Great car. The gasolina. Come on, baby. Come on, man. Alright, so we just filled up. We had 357 kilometers on 36.1 liters, which is 10 liters per 100 kilometers. Uh, Crappy fuel economy. Here we are, the Golden Civic Center. <laughs> Woo! All right, we were getting pretty restless in the car, so we decided to stop at Golden, hit a skate park, grab some food, and then we're on the road again. 
All right, I don't know if I'm gonna regret this or not, but Sarah's driving my pride and joy, my baby, my girl. I thought I was your girl. Anything you're forgetting? Park break. Take two. There we go, easy as pie. Honda Civic, pie. baby. Floor it. What? No. Floor it. I can't. Legacy GT, eh? <laughs> oh, scared me for it. oh, nice crackles. Woo! First impressions, be honest. It's it's easy to do because I'm not used to standard, but it's slow. I floored it and I felt okay to floor it, you know? There you go. Okay, I'm back in the driver's seat now. We stopped for a little food at Gita's drive-in diner. I don't Can't know what it's called. It was really good. Back in the road. Alberta now. Somebody got pulled over here. Oh yeah, my camera died. We stopped at a skate park in Cochrane and now we're back to Edmonton, about 170k left to my mom's place for some turkey dinner. So we're just getting into Edmonton now. The Civ Rocket was doing better once we got into Alberta, fuel economy wise and driving wise, like keeping up with the speed limit. And now it's starting to, as of the last hour or two, feel like it's, it has a lot of drag again. So I think it might be that front wheel bearing because it's not wanting to coast very much now. And I'm actually gonna go this way. Anyways, that's basically it for tonight. Stay tuned for the next few videos to see what the plan is with this car, what the future plans are, and what the build is gonna be. And until next time,